Hey y'all, Irix Guy here. Now today I want to talk about how to disable a new feature that comes with uh, Mac OS X Mavericks. Now this feature is called AppNap, and it's part of the uh, part of the the main themes behind Mac OS X Mavericks, and that's conserving battery life. Now if you use a uh, if you use a desktop Mac, you may not be as concerned about that. So in my case, what I wanted to do, I wanted to disable the app nap from various applications. Now, unfortunately, at the time of posting this video, there's not a universal way to disable app nap. So you got to do it on a, a per application basis. So all that you do, and I'm going to do it in Final Cut Pro because I found that uh, that the app nap can adversely affect the performance of Final Cut Pro and, and when I say that I mean that I do a lot of uh, I do a lot of videos for Iron Skies Adventure Channel and having that app nap enabled has slowed me down a little bit so to disable app nap per application all you do is right mouse click on it and say get info and then there's a box right here under general that says uh, that says prevent app nap Check that, exit, and if you want to go back into it, just to confirm that this setting stuck, you can go in there and see that. Now that's how to do it for most apps. Now there are some apps like Safari, the web browser. If you go to Safari, you're not going to see a box that will enable you to, uh, to disable AppNap. But there's a way around that. So you can open your terminal, and what you can do is... Uh, is paste in this command. Now I've already got it. I've got it saved, so I'm just going to paste it in there so you can see. So that's the command. I hit enter, and that's going to uh, disable AppNap for Safari. Now what you'll see right here, this is the part that says to disable it for Safari, com.apple.safari. So that'll vary among applications that you may want to uh, disable AppNap for, but that's uh, that's how you would do it for Safari is entering that command. Now unfortunately this command has to be re-entered. Well, I've been told it has to be re-entered after, uh, after each reboot. Not for the apps like Final Cut Pro I was able to do it through the uh, through the right mouse click right mouse click get info but for apps like Safari if you reboot you're gonna have to uh, you're gonna have to rerun this command. So hopefully, uh, hopefully Apple will push out some sort of fix. Now, I'm not saying it's broken. I'm just saying it's less than optimal for me when I'm running on uh, when I'm running on wall plug. Because my iMac, obviously, it's not portable. Now for my MacBook Air, it's nice to have these power saving features because I'm not concerned about the speed. But when I'm at my when I'm in my studio. I like to have maximum speed possible. So hopefully Apple will unveil a way to universally disable AppNap in a, in a future update to Mavericks. But this is how you can do it in the interim. Uh, so I hope that this video is of value. Please feel free to, uh, to share with others and subscribe if you haven't already. It's youtube.com forward slash Guy. Y'all have a good day.